I, I think you you make a case in the book that our Western diet does also does not support a healthy biome and or microbiome. So what what's going on there? Why why is what we're eating now compared to what we ate in the past as a species uh, maybe making things not so optimal for our, for our microbes? Right. And the answer here kind of surprised me when I started researching um, the book. I was really interested in the probiotic and fermented foods, and it seemed like such this interesting kind of sexy topic these days. Um, and it's everywhere now, you know, even my local Target. Um, don't have to just go to the farmer's market anymore to get kimchi. <laughs> yeah. But um, when I started researching the book, it's really not as much about these probiotic fermented foods as it is about fiber, which is not usually a very interesting topic. <laughs> or, you know, people don't think of it as an interesting food quality. By, by the way, that's my, my my wife is a dietitian and that's actually her favorite topic. So I've, I've definitely like recommended this book to her because <laughs> she loves that's to awesome. talk about fiber. So she, she's, she's, been, she's been validated. <laughs> she's validated by, <laughs> by your book. So that's yes. great. Yes. Yeah. So, um, so fiber is really the key. We, you know, we have all these micro in, their, in our gut that we're just starting to learn about, but um, we've been neglecting to feed them well. Um, and in the past, for you know most of our evolution, our diets were extremely heavy in fiber. We were eating tubers, you know, and nuts and berries and seeds and all of these things that are very high in fiber. But just recently, even really in the last hundred years or so, we started refining our foods so much that we've really taken the fiber out of them. And of course, these days you can get foods with fiber added back in, right, right. <laughs> but that's not quite the same as having this diverse diet of these kind of natural fibers, um, because that's another aspect is we want to cultivate these diverse microbiomes for our health. Um, and that means feeding them a diversity of fibers because different microbes prefer different types of fiber. So it's not just about supplementing with one single type of fiber as much as it is eating this kind of diverse, fibrous, more uh -huh. rustic diet, I think. <laughs>